Okay, so who in here um knows how to make a table? Not a wooden table that you eat on, but like uh when you make uh, a graph you make a table with it. What is that? Just eat. Cool. Who if we made a table, how would you know would any of you know how to um example would be um, to figure out how many boys or girls in the class like either sports or anime. Go sports or anime as two different worlds, right? Almost. Anybody would anybody know how to figure that out without having to each and every person ask them? I think a poll that's a good answer. Yeah. Alright, well I'm gonna have y'all help me make a poll. Well, we're gonna figure out who in here either likes sports or likes anime. And you gotta pick one. Don't don't say Oh, I don't like sports or anime, or I like those sports and anime. If you do, that's great. That's awesome. But for the sake of this, pick one. What's going to be like more than the other, okay? So we're going to make a, first make a table. And I'm not going to draw at all, so. Okay. We'll do girls on top. You don't see that? Of course, that's what it is. Ah, he's a good boy. Alright. Right inside. The right. so girls at the top, boys at the bottom. Right? Up here, we're gonna do sports. And here we'll do ants. So you got to pick one. It doesn't matter if you like both. Just choose one, which would be like one. So uh, for boys, we'll do boys first. Because boys, won't just get right out of here. <laughs> boys, if you like sports more, raise your hand. And I'm. We're gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like sports more than. Anything. So I say nine. All right. If you like anime, boys again, if you like anime more, raise your hand. One, two, Casey, you didn't raise your hand at all, so which one are you? Hand three. Right. three. So, in theory, we should have 12 total boys in the class, right? So, if you're, let's, let's check. If you're a boy, raise your hand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So, somebody. I need four eight to go to the cafeteria at this time. Four eight to go to the cafeteria at this time. Austin, do you like sports more or do you like anime? Neither. We just got to pick one. What's going on? If you had to suffer through one, which one would you pick? Like we scored. So we're going to change this to 10. Cool. Alright, so I'm going to change this to 10. Alright, and then we're going to go to the boys. We added 10 plus 3, you got 13. Alright, girls, if you like sports more, raise your hand. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 girls. If you like sports more. If you like anime, raise your hand. 1, 2, 3. Alright. So we've got 8 girls total. Raise your hand if you're a girl. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Great. Much better than the so we add five plus three, you got eight girl, eight girls total in the class. Alright, so how many according to this table, how many students, not boys or girls, how many students total like sports men? Fifteen. Fifteen. That's pretty easy, right? What about him? Six. Six, six, pretty easy. Twenty-one. Twenty-one students in the class. So we just figured out how many students in the class by simply. I didn't have to ask or sit here and count. I, I I'd already gotten this information from who likes sports more, who likes anime more, and was able to uh, pull that out. So this right here is called a two-way free throw. 
frequency table. Two-way frequency table. And we've got two different types of data. We've got sports and anime. So this is bivariant data. Bi just means two. <coughs> Variant is two different variables. So this is one variable, this is two variables. So this is bivariant data. Okay? And uh, we're collecting numerical data because these are numbers. If we were, uh, there's two, two types of data. There's categorical data and there's numerical data. If there's numbers, we can count specifically number wise how many of uh, something that there is, that'd be numerical. If I were to ask, um, let's say for categorical, if I were to ask, do you like blue, the color blue, or do you like the color red? All right, let's stick with sports. Do you like sports or do you like anime? I would just, you would just say yes or no. You can't put a number on it. I didn't want y'all to put a number on it. I don't know how many boys. I just want to know, do boys like sports or anime? So it'd be yes or no. That's categorical. You can't count. There's no number. Numerical, you know, there's a number. There's a numerical number. Right? So now, y'all just learned how to do two inferences. Y'all did it. That was all y'all. Good job. We're going to pass out. Josh is going to help me pass this out. This packet, everyone needs one. Thank you. Y'all just hold on to that sheet right now. Alright, I'm going to ask a few more questions about this uh, table. And I just want you to use, like, uh, just kind of use your brain a little bit to, to solve these. This isn't a trick question. It's just think, uh, listen carefully to the question, what's being asked. Out of girls total, how many like sports? And how would you write that as a fraction? So, out of total amount of girls, how many like sports? Eight, eight over 21. Eight over 21. That would be total girls over total students. I want to know out of the girls, just out of this eight five. girls, how many like sports? Oh, 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 raise your hand. Let's raise our hand. Okay. Five over eight. Five over eight. Great. All right. How many out of total girls, how many like anime? Raise your hand. Wilson? Three over eight. Three over eight. Great. All right. Let's move on to boys. Out of total boys, how many like sports? Jamario? Ten over thirteen. Awesome. All right. Let's do uh, how many boys like, out of how many total boys, how many like anime? Three over thirteen. Three over thirteen. Great. All right. Now, out of the total students, put your hand out of, your, out of the total students, how many students like sports? Out of all the students. You said, what number? 15 or 20? Cool. That's good. That's correct. I have told students how many like anime. Andy? 6 over 21? Cool. Do y'all know John? Alright, so with this packet y'all just got? Yeah, two. Alright. Everybody got a packet? So the first sheet goes over what numerical data is. It's data consisting of numbers. We already went over that. Uh, y'all are just going to read these questions. It gives y'all 
a, a, a box right here with the number of suits. You can make your own. This box gives you the numbers without putting it in a table. If you were to put it in a table, it'd, be, it'd look just like that. So if you need to make a table to help, you can do that. But we're just going to look at these numbers, use the data to answer the questions below. So we're just going to answer these questions with those numbers. How many students are in the class? Don't, you'll just have to add up. So I'm going to give you all a, a chance to do that on your own. See what see you're at. I want you to do the first page. I want you to do the whole thing. Second sheet, before y'all start. Second sheet, you're going to label whether or not these examples are categorical or numerical. If they're categorical, you're going to rewrite the question to make it numerical. If it's numerical, you can rewrite it to make it categorical. It gives you an example of how to do that on the first one. Third sheet, they give you a chart. They want you to finish filling out. Or they give you a table. They want you to finish filling out the table. And then answer the questions just like when I was asking. It's going to be the same type of questions that I was just asking. Last page. Gonna make your own you're gonna make your own frequency table. So you're gonna use the data on the previous page to complete the table. It should be simple. You're just gonna finish filling out this table and then transfer it over here and uh, answer those questions. So you're gonna get about uh, ten minutes to do that. So the whole time. Yeah. Yeah, just fill out what you can. Oh, I just want to do that. 